another food review. I'm your host, Captain Joe Shoes, and today we are here at Taco Bell to try out the new shredded beef grilled cheese dipping taco. But before we get started, please remember to like this video, subscribe to the channel, get down in the comments, tell me if you've had this, if you like it, if you don't like it, what you'd like to see from it, or any other comments that may come around. But here we are, I love grilled cheese, I love dipping, and I love tacos. So we're here to check this out. This is what it looks like, right here. It is a fucking mess. So right off the bat, that's an issue. If you want me to hold on to this and dip it, we already have an issue. I would love right off the bat to say that I love this, but I've got issues immediately because they want you to take this thing and dip it in a little thing of salsa like this. They want you to take this thing and dip it in a little thing of cheese like this. And that all sounds great. But when it's something this size, it's not made for dipping. In all honesty, when I heard this was first announced, I'm excited over what could be. Grilled cheese, yeah. Tacos, great. Dip it, sure. But now you've given me a mess that's gonna be all over my hands. And it's not even appropriate dipping size. This is like getting a tortilla that's way too big for the salsa jar. So this is already a big mistake. And I'm sure it's good because one of my favorite fast food items ever at any location is the grilled cheese double steak burrito. That thing is incredible. And sure, you got your melted cheese on the outside that's gonna get all over your fingers and stuff, but it's in a burrito, it's wrapped up nice. Really, the only issue with that is that stuff kind of slides to the bottom. So maybe you're not getting the sour cream or something in every bite, because when you hold the burrito, things fall to the bottom. This already, I, I already have issues with. And it's very, very hot, obviously, because it's coming off their grill. But they want us to dip it, and we're gonna dip it. So I'm going to attempt, even through the foil and the paper, it's very hot on my hands, which, I mean, it's a good thing. You don't want cold food, but at the same time, you gotta make it manageable for me, pal. We have a regular crunchy taco, cheese on the outside, on the inside, shredded beef, and shredded beef, and what looks to be like that sauce that they put on the cheesy gordita crunch. So you get that cheese sauce on the inside too. Now, if you wanna tell me that this is made for dipping, sure, sure, we can say that. So we did, we put a little salsa on it. Ah. And that's fine. But look, it does not fit. It does not fit. And if it does not fit, you must acquit. Ah. Hmm. Now, I like the idea of this. Anything that gives me more of that grilled cheese on the outside, I think is a pretty cool idea. But because it's so messy, it sticks to the wrapper, it pulls apart like, just like so. I gotta fold it over. Messy, messy, messy. And because it's so hot, you can't even hold it to dip. So who exactly are we making happy? Is it tasty? Sure, it's tasty. It's a taco with melted cheese on the outside of the shell. Great. But if the gimmick is that you should be able to dip it, you have to be able to work the gimmick. And having something this size as a dipping thing does not work. These should have been like little frozen Jose Ole tacos. You get like five of them in like a little chicken tender bag and you dip them. You dip them because they're dipping size. They're dipping appropriate sizes. And that's what you should be doing here. So, I mean, look, is it tasty? Sure. But because this is almost impossible to be held, now I just gotta pour. I gotta pour on it. Mm.
I got a look at that. Dripping cheese, dripping beef. Ah. Ah. Mm. Ah. Mm. Tasty. It sure is. It sure is tasty. But the functionality of this item is not very good. Not very good at all. But I love Taco Bell. I love Taco Bell more than I love a lot of my family. So I'm here to support and I'm here to try and I'm here to be unbiased. So that's why I got two. A lot of times you can't tell with just one. So I bought a second one. This one a little neater. I wouldn't say significantly neater, but here we are. And now I'm gonna try it. The sauce is actually pretty tasty with it. You know, it's regular Taco Bell salsa. Salsa. I like that. Oh, making a mess here at the Taco Bell. Now we're gonna try it with the cheese sauce, which sounds like overkill to me. I don't know if we needed cheese sauce to be on the grilled cheese dipping taco that already has cheese on the outside, cheese sauce on the inside. But now we get the regular nacho cheese that we've come to know and love after all these years. This guy with his big, big truck and tiny, tiny dick passing by. So look at that, that's not, that's not dipping appropriate here. Ah. Mm. Is too much cheese a bad thing? No. And I love this cheese sauce. Mm. And for each one, they do give you a salsa and a cheese sauce, which is nice. Maybe you only like one or the other. Maybe you want a little bit of both. Mm. I'm not necessarily someone who likes to mix and match, but like I said, the gimmick here is that we're supposed to be dipping. And they have made it very difficult to enjoy it the way it's supposed to be enjoyed. Especially because the outside layer of cheese that gets melted on sticks to the paper and ends up ripping your taco because the generic hard taco shell is easily breakable. Mm. And now, you factor in all the stickety goodness from the cheese and the meat on the inside, and it's just very pliable, too much so. Mm. Way too easy to break apart. Mm. 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 So there we go, two of Taco Bell's new shredded beef grilled cheese dipping tacos. On taste alone, it's good. It's good, it's something I would want, but they have to figure something out with the way the wrapper sticks to it and tears it apart. And this is not dipping size. That is, uh, it's gotta be the biggest complaint because you're advertising, this is for dipping. And it's obviously not made for dipping. I really think the way to go would be mini tacos, be able to dip. That would have been the way to go with this. Unfortunately, they didn't go that route. So because of that, I gotta take off major points. It's tasty. I'd probably order it again because I enjoy it. But the fact of the matter is, it's not what I was hoping it would be. So I'm gonna give it like a double main man, two stars because the functionality for eating, something you gotta eat with your hands and make an absolute mess and get it all over and have it falling apart and have it falling out of the taco, it's not what it should be. So double main man, two stars. I wish I liked this a lot more. I wish it was better equipped to be able to do what it was supposed to do. 
Thank you guys for watching. Remember to like the video, subscribe to the channel, get down in the comments, tell me what you think. I know that's probably a hot take that I just had. People seem to really like it, but let me know what you think in the comments. Otherwise, thanks for watching.